Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Vishwagatu and this is Vichy Studio. It's been a while since I've made my last video and uh, you guys have been following along with me for the past little while with uh, this setup. So yeah, um, what you're basically seeing is uh, my video off of my phone and uh, most of it is upscaled from my post anyway. So. That's why you guys get to see this but uh, i decided finally that it's time to give it an upgrade so this is how the video looks before and this is how the video looks after uh so i've upgraded my camera setup as you can see so i went with the canon eos m50 mirrorless camera this was my first mirrorless camera purchase so i was really excited for it firstly it came with the manuals and the warranty card And it came with a few accessories, which included the neck strap, the battery, which was a Canon LP E12, and the charger. It also came with the kit lens, which is 15 to 45 millimeters. And this lens is perfect for beginning. And finally came the camera. There are many reasons why I took this camera, but the main reasons are that it has a 24.1 megapixel CMOS sensor, which comes in high-end cameras. It comes with dual pixel autofocus, a flipping LCD display which is also touchscreen and the main reason that it records at 4K Ultra HD at 24 frames per second which is a bit nerfed compared to the top end models because it's a bit cropped and uh, it loses its dual pixel autofocus but that's manageable. And finally I can even use this camera as a webcam using the Canon EOS webcam utility which makes it perfect. The audio quality it goes from this to sounding like this. Uh, I guess there's a bit of a noticeable difference as I upgraded the microphone to a Tackstar SGC 598 shotgun microphone. And the main reason that I took this microphone was because it was perfectly in my budget and it was really comparable to some of the top end microphones in the budget section like the Rode uh, VideoMic or the Shure VP83F and I also went ahead and bought the newer tripod that comes with a ring light and a soft light diffuser and it comes with other accessories like uh, the phone holder and it also comes with the power adapter the orange light filters the carry bag and a bluetooth controller for taking pictures from your phone wirelessly and you can use the warm light filters for having warm light and uh, the normal white filters for having uh, a bit cooler light and you can use the light diffuser for getting soft light which is always perfect for videography and photography and the main reason that I took this tripod is that uh, it can stretch up to uh, I think 78 inches which is uh, really amazing and the other main reason that I went for this tripod is that it came perfectly within my budget and after these I went ahead and bought other little accessories for the camera which include a camera case of course and uh, an SD card. For the SD card I chose the SanDisk Extreme because of its speeds that go up to 160 Mbps and they'll be really useful for transferring data at fast speeds and uh, for shooting 4K Ultra HD videos. So yeah, uh, I really hope you guys enjoy my videos from now on. I really hope this new upgrade to my channel will enable me to give you guys better content, better quality videos and uh, better quality audio. And for the upcoming PC videos, I hope uh, I'll be able to take really good quality videos of the PC build. So stay tuned for the classic builds and uh, high-end, high-performance builds that are coming up. I guess the first one I'll be uploading would be a uh, Ryzen 7 uh, 5800X and I really hope you guys enjoy this video and audio quality for my videos and uh, I'll appreciate any kinds of suggestions from you guys. So thank you guys and uh, see you in the next one.